I wonder if this is the right thing to do. I made the arrangements as you have requested. The match with that person will be live video streamed all over the world. <sighs> My unveiling. I will be exposed to the entire world. Yes, but I wonder if it's good to expose your divinity. Reveal your mission to the humble masses. That I do not mind, Colleen. When the time of the prophecy comes, when all is revealed, then the people of the world will rejoice, already knowing who I am. And it seems that time is rapidly approaching, my child. Ah, uh, yes. I trust in you, Lord Gil. When the new utopia is ushered in, the world will look at you with the same awe and appreciation that I already have. Hmm. Utopia? Uh. Indeed, Colleen. You were able to see that. Yes, there is nothing to worry about. During my revelation, the ignorant will see it the way that the ignorant wish to see. And the wise will see it the way the wise wish to see. But in the end, when the time comes, everyone will be able to achieve their hopes and dreams. Under my guiding hand, with the light of harmony. Yes. Then we shall go. That person. I wish to see him for myself. Well, well. The ancient Earthling reveals himself. Mysterious power. Not prophesized. Let me fight. Meteor! Let me ask, what is it you see when you gaze upon me? What is it that I am seeing? There is no point discussing that. My vision and what we are looking for have always been one. Your answer is most obtuse. I'll rephrase. What do you wish for my gate of harmony? What are your plans? Good sir, we are all Earthlings, and therefore must all have one wish, and that is... ...to become one with the Earth, and I, who is President of the World! It is an odd feeling, but... ...the power of this one. I know I have felt it somewhere before, but where? At last. At last he reveals himself. Girl! Damn him! How can he reveal himself in such an idiotic manner? Just to attract public attention. To do it for that reason alone is an unforgivable transgression. So, rat. Why don't you bring Gil to me? Uh, Lord Urien! Did you think I was unaware that you were sneaking around, plotting with the Emperor? I was just simply following the Oath of Allegiance to our secret society. Don't waste your breath. Just get him!
Now we'll know which one of us shall rule! Turn to harmony. Seraphic wing! You must accept your fate. Why? Why can't I defeat you? I think you know the reason why. Everything is as the prophecy has been written. All that was, is, or will be has been destined. Then I'll destroy that accursed prophecy! Fear not. Your time as my spare will soon be at an end. <gasps> Did you just call me your spare? How dare you insult me like that! You will never fulfill your mission to be my replacement. You will never serve any purpose at all. That is because... Only I will be able to achieve the wish of our organization. The dream for the last 2,000 years. I, the Emperor Gil. Enough of this, you bastard! When I fulfill this long-awaited wish, the prophecy that binds you and I and the tenets we all follow will disappear. And then you can live any way you like. Wait! I... Look at me! Girl! Please, look at me! 